So in this tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to turn your gameplay from this to this. So stay tuned. What's going on guys? It's Valence and back with the video and today I'm going to teach you guys how to get Play-Doh graphics on Valorant. So if you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys subscribe, turn on notifications and leave a like on the video. And if you guys want more videos like this, make sure you guys subscribe and if you guys have any questions, just leave them down below and I'll try to answer them all. First off, you guys go into the description below and download this file. Once you guys have this file, all you have to do is extract it and you guys are going to get these two files. So one is a folder and one is a text file. So open up the text file and then copy this value and we're going to use it later on. And next you guys have to open NVIDIA Inspector. Open up this file and then click on this one with the green icon. Make sure you guys have administrator access or it might not work for you. Now that you guys have this open, click on this gears icon right in the middle of the screen. Well, not really in the middle, but to the right. Click on that. It's going to take a few seconds to load and then you guys are going to get this big window. At the top of the profiles, you guys need to find Valorant. If you guys don't have Valorant, click on any game that isn't installed on your computer. So, for example, if there was a game called Helicopter, click on Helicopter, and then you guys could change the EXE to the location of Valorant. But I'll show you guys how to do that after. But we're going to click on Profiles and type in Valorant. So now that we do have Valorant because NVIDIA updated their profiles, now we click on Valorant and now it's so much simpler. All we got to do is go to anti-aliasing, replay mode all, and then scroll down to LOD bias, DX, and then paste that value. Once we're finished that, click on apply changes. and now all you have to do is close it and start up Valorant. Once you guys start up Valorant, it should look like this. And if you guys want to undo what you just did, all you have to do is go back to NVIDIA Inspector like this. Click on this green button right here. It's going to restore it to default. Once you guys clicked on that, it should be finished. Click on apply changes and that's all. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If this helped you guys out, make sure you guys smash that like button. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you guys for watching. Peace out.